Since the dawn of time, hunters have provided meat for the table. Hunting has always been a necessary component of survival. That is until the advancement in commercial food processing created a culture and an opportunity where meat is for sale in grocery stores everywhere. And we find ourselves in a society that has by and large removed themselves from the process that is necessary in order to have meat on one's table. The relevance in hunting in our modern day civilization is often questioned. The days of hunting being an activity that every household participated in is now replaced with a majority of citizenry that does not hunt. Hunters are now the minority. The joy that more than 12 million hunters all across the nation find in hunting is often misunderstood. Anti-hunters often question why we should hunt when we can just go to the store and buy meat. And surely it doesn't help when hunters are made out to be villains in children's movies. All of this adds up to a culture that does not understand hunting and views the ethical harvest and processing of a wild animal is barbaric and unnecessary. The fact of the matter is that most Americans never think about where their food comes from. Hunters know where their food comes from and the process that went into putting that meat into their freezer. The local vor and bioorganic movement is one of the latest trends in meat and produce consumption, but it is not a new concept to hunters, nor is it a trend. It is a lifestyle of the hunter and the angler, and the amount of meat that is sustainably harvested annually by hunters and anglers is not only significant, but it is healthy for wildlife populations and healthy for the consumption of clean, lean, hormone-free meat. If you will, it is the original inorganic. And contrary to popular belief, hunting is more relevant today than ever before. The value of wild, sustainably harvested food is often overlooked. Yet the concern for both health and food security has never in my lifetime been more important. The COVID-19 virus has created a food crisis that is causing meat shortages that are leaving the shelves of grocery stores bare and people are at an increased risk of going hungry. In the United States alone, there are more than 12 million hunters and 33 million anglers that look to hunting and fishing in order to provide meat for their families. If you were to remove all of their meat from their freezer, there would be a run on grocery stores that would increase our current food security crisis to a level of epic proportions. Think about it this way. The average bull elk yields 218 pounds of meat and the average buck deer yields 40 pounds of meat. If you do the math, Let's say, for example, of those 12 million hunters, every one of them gets a single buck deer. That equates to 480 million pounds of sustainably harvested wild game meat. And at six ounces per serving, that equates to nearly 1.3 billion meals. You can now take that number and multiply it by the number of hunters that harvest more than one deer, plus elk, antelope, moose, wild turkey, ducks, fish, and other wild game taken by hunters. The majority of these hunters and anglers source their meat from hunting, limiting the amount that they even shop in the grocery store for meat. And not only are these hunters feeding their families, hunters are donating millions of pounds of meat to food banks and needy families around the country. Just imagine the food crisis that our country would currently be in without hunting. The role that hunting plays in food security cannot be understated. And the anti-hunter argument that hunting is not relevant in today's society could not be farther from the truth. Hunting is vital for the nourishment at America's dinner tables. But beyond that, the hunter-generated dollars that create the primary source of funding for state and federal wildlife agencies and the excise taxes on hunting equipment so far have generated more than $12.5 billion specifically for conservation over the last 75 years. And with that, it's more evident that hunting is essential 
as hunting is conservation. To learn more, go to www.rmef.org.